In today's video, just get started. Hey guys, what's going on? This is Paul Ravella from ProPhysique.com and if you like my shirt, well, you can thank Mr. Mark Lobliner. My show is tomorrow, the OCB Florida West Coast Classic, and I keep calling it my show, but it's really our show. So many people go into making this show possible, and uh, without Mark's support of natural bodybuilding, it would not be nearly what it is. So the shirts came in, all the stuff came in for the competitors from MTS Nutrition, so thank you, Mark, as always. You can check out the back here, some of the sponsor logos. Really cool, um, Icon Meals, I got my buddy Tour de Pizza on there, Matt, thank you. He's bringing out some macro-friendly pizzas for the competitors. We've got Team Unique Prep, Mr. Michael Pucci sponsored the show, so thank you for that. And, uh, you know, got myself on there as well. But overall, it's just going to be a great event because of all the support that I've gotten. And um, I know this video is probably going to be a bit rambly because I've got a lot on my mind, a lot going on right now. The big stuff that's going on is my show tomorrow and then next week on Thursday, Lauren and I are driving down to Miami for NPC National. So those are the big things. But yesterday, and I'm going to include some clips um, of the event, Yesterday was an event at the University of South Florida. The students of exercise science invited myself and Lauren to come talk about how to build your fitness business. And it's always weird for me to be asked to do something like this because I was never the guy doing that. I was always the guy attending. So it's nice to think that I could potentially be helping someone else out in their journey. And we had a pretty good attendance. I think there was over 30 people there. Uh, Lauren and I spoke, we did a Q&A, we met with some people afterwards, but mostly what I'm most excited about is that the University of South Florida, the students there, recognize that there are some good things going on in the fitness industry. I think for a lot of people, the fitness industry or fitness professionals can have a negative connotation, but I just see so much opportunity and so many good things going on. So I was able and Lauren was able to just kind of give our perspective on our journeys because especially for someone my age, the process of getting to where our careers are now, it wasn't laid out. It took a lot of, it took a lot of like just leaps of faith and just getting out there and doing it. And um, the theme for yesterday, it kept coming up was just getting started. Like, you know, I think years ago, even YouTube videos, now that I love all my YouTube buddies, um, even the thought of putting out a YouTube video was very intimidating. Like, why should I do that? Who would listen to me? It was a very weird thing. But when you just do it, you find out that you get feedback and you start to build some momentum and you start to enjoy the process. It's the same thing with anything else, whether it be social media stuff or just stepping outside your comfort zone. Even this bodybuilding show, I remember when I thought about putting on this bodybuilding show, it, it was very nerve wracking, you know, but I said, you know what, let's just do it and see what happens. Worst case scenario, when you make a decision and, and, and agree to do something or try something out, you can always decide that it's not for you. But if you never try things, then you'll never really know. And if you never push yourself, you'll never really know what you're capable of or what you enjoy. So I don't want this to sound preachy. I don't have all the answers. But what I do like to do is just share how I got here and be honest about that. And for those that attended yesterday and for Lauren, um, I think it's great. And we, Lauren and I, have just been doing so much good stuff this year. And it's nice to know that it's well received because I'll be honest, it's a lot of work, you know, and I, and I don't like to use that word work lightly because as someone who's worked in construction, worked in a restaurant, I've worked in a factory, uh, I've, I've literally dug ditches. So to me, work, the connotation can mean like some very, very tough stuff, like actual physical manual labor. That's work. My work now, although technically time demanding, and intensive emotionally kind of sometimes it can be stressful um, you know good things happen bad things happen but overall it's still work right it's just it's just takes different forms and I think I used to get caught up in thinking like being on the computer wasn't work because I was so used to you know putting in work like with a shovel or in a kitchen 
now I realize work can take on many forms. So the big message for today, I just wanted to show you guys some clips. I wanted to get caught up with you because I don't know what video is going to look like for tomorrow. I have a videographer for my show, so Mr. Colin DeWay is going to be there all day getting footage. And so that's going to be really fun. And then, you know, I don't know what type of video I'll be able to get out this weekend. If something, I'll probably put something out on Sunday because I just like to keep in touch with you guys. I don't like to be off of YouTube for too long. I feel like we have a good thing going on, guys, so let's keep it happening. And then next week will be really fun because Chad Nutter shows up. That's right. He's coming to Miami. Welcome to Miami. Well, anyway, sorry to get off on a, on a dance topic, but I get excited thinking about NPC Nationals because Team Pro Physique is freaking bringing it to Nationals. I am so excited. I'm bringing like so many overall champions from NPC shows this year just to just to really show off their stuff on the national stage and we'll see. Everyone there is, a, is, is amazing, but uh, I've got five bikini competitors, a men's physique competitor, currently one classic physique competitor and another that might qualify today or tomorrow, sorry, Saturday. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be uh, really amazing and I didn't even mention my figure competitor. She looks amazing. So yeah, it's just gonna be a really crazy weekend full on in Miami. And I realize I'm probably rambling now because I'm going all over the place. But this is as real as it gets, guys. My brain is so scattered right now, I can't tell you. I'm excited about my show. I'm excited about Nationals, but I'm excited for like December, where I can kind of step back, regroup, get caught up on some things that kind of get pushed to the side, a little bit of projects that I have been working on. Um, I can't wait to get my garage. Like, you, you should see it right now. There's like 90 trophies on the floor, cardboard boxes everywhere. Can't wait to get this back so I can actually use this for training and so some content. And I'm gonna start a fat loss phase because, let's face it, um, I could be a little leaner and I kinda wanna compete next year, but as you guys know, uh, life complicates, so I'd rather get ahead of schedule. So I'd like to document some of that. So you see where my brain just went, like 64 directions? So I have a little bit of attention deficit issue right now because I have so many things going on but I feel like they're positive things. So I figured I'd just share all that with you guys. I'm gonna try to do as much as I can on Instagram stories. Um, being the show promoter, it's a little bit hectic on show day, but I have so many good people helping me. I have um, the most amazing assistant, Karina Noboa. She has just stepped up the game this year. I have not ever gotten so much good feedback about my show from all the communication. Um, so tomorrow's gonna go very well, thanks to Karina, but yeah. That's going to be it for me today, guys. Sorry for the all over the place nature of this. I'm going to include some clips now of what went on yesterday. And uh, now someone's doing the lawn across the street, so it's time to go. Thank you, guys, and I'll talk to you soon, hopefully tomorrow or Sunday. Have a great day. Oh.